We're actually gonna bring in the new year. I think a good way to celebrate 2019 is by trying to see how long I can survive with 2019 dollars. I know, very original, very original challenge. So we gotta find a setup that can beat a lot of rounds with only 2019. So let me go to Sandbox first to find a strategy that's going to work. So let me start with 20k, just to show a baseline, just so we don't go over $2019. So basically we gotta be above 17981. So we can basically take the strategy really really similarly to the cheapest way to beat inflation, which was, if you didn't know, Gwen, 003. This will beat 60 rounds, but we can go further because we have extra money to spare. So I think one thing that might work is this. 023, Ace, and we actually only spent 2015, so we're about 4 years late to this challenge, but this might be a strategy that will go pretty far with 2019. So let me try this first. But here's the catch, I'm going to play on easy mode. I'm not going to play deflation because the thing is if you start from round 1, you can actually get Gwen a high, much higher level, much higher level, versus round 30. If we can show that Gwendolyn plus a crossbow can beat 60 rounds, starting on 30, we definitely could go a lot further, can't we? Let's get all our monies upgraded first, and then we're basically playing deflation from there. Our final ace, I think figure 8 is good. Infinite might do okay, but it gets a little, it goes a little too far left here. So we'll leave it for now. And this is basically 2015 spent, and we'll see how far this goes. So round 30. This is where Deflation starts, and Gwen is currently in cell level 3. She is 4 levels higher. Those 4 levels actually might make a pretty, pretty big difference. So a good thing to keep a baseline of is, I do know that Gwen gets level 10 at round 57. So we're gonna see when she gets level 10, just to see, you know, the difference. This round's kinda hard. Just cause like, the crossbow is the only thing that can pop camos, at least right now. So, let's use the fire now, oh that was pretty bad. The thing is we just wanna prevent a Rigo farm. I'm not sure this is the right position for it, no. No. Should I restart this one? 188, you know what, we're gonna leave it, we're gonna leave it. I don't think we're that anal lives too much, so we should be fine. Could take a few lives lost. Let's put Gwen on close. That might do better, honestly. Come on, close. Yes, 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 that's good, that's good. Perfect. So we are gonna leak a few lives. Just a few though, hopefully. Gwen back to first, down to 70, I'll take 70, just because this round's really hard anyway, so I don't think, so I don't think we do much better than that, but anyways, we got level 10, 5 levels earlier than if we start on deflation, so not bad. How many pops does the ace have? 6,000, wow. You see, this guy only cost us 300, and it's already done this, this much work for us. Pretty good work for us, I gotta say. Also, level 11 is really close. However, I cannot spend the 22 bucks. That would put us over 2019. Use fire now. So we basically use the fire every round of the 50s. Just because we can. And do we need to use anything for this last wave? I don't think so. We should be fine. Might leak a few though. Ah well, I'll take it. Eh, 47. Probably could have lost zero lives. Ah, whatever. That's fine. Although, like, I swear to god those 23 lives are going to bite me in the ass someday. One day or another. So level 11 now, awesome. Level 12 is still pretty far away though. So we're only going to have to roll with extra range on Gwen, not that great. Fire. And then that fire. There are balloons getting really far though, I don't know about this. JK, we're fine. Now for 61 and we have no abilities to start the round. Um, that's not good. And a Rigo farm, nice. Poor Saul in the wound, we got a Rigo farm going on. Guess we'll drop a quick fire to contain it. Wait. No, we're dead there. Try again. There's not much we can do other than hope that it doesn't regrow to death, honestly. Like, how do we hope that it doesn't regrow? 26. You know, these 23 lives would have been really handy right now. And we're gonna regrow to death there, aren't we? Yes. If only we had the fire at the start of the round so that it didn't regrow to death. Things you wish you could have changed, but it's too late. 
Maybe we can micro our ace so that it doesn't regrow like this. But how about this? We are so close. No. We're dead there. Let's see if it does not regrow as much if we sell our ace. So, use that now. And any regrow farm? Let's see. Yeah, the ace is actually... Nope, no, 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 no. Wow. Try again. We gotta get the fire thrown here. That ain't gonna work, is it? 38 lives, 22. 20, no. We kinda messed up here, yeah. We're dead. Let's try a different layout then. Because we messed up on 60 there. What if we get, instead of a crossbow for camo, we get a boat for camos. Like this. We have 199 to spend. So we can basically spend the money on one more Dark Monkey. Or buy this, but I think it's better we get one more 000. zero, zero. So this. That's our layout. Total spent, 1990. This might work. Will this beat round 61? Play? Maybe it can be 61 like this. Granted, I think we gotta try again with the Ace, honestly. Use Fire here. Uh, we can beat this round, we can beat this round. I think we just messed up with the other layout late earlier. Should we just restart from the start, like the other one? Because we can totally beat this. Unfortunately, we have nothing to spend our extra 29 bucks on. But that's fine. We don't really need it. So, as for where to put my two Zuzu Dude Dark Monkeys, doesn't matter because they're going to one shot everything, right? Maybe in alternate worlds, but no. We'll just drop them here, one and two. And then a 0 one two here. I feel like the spread of the grape shots would do a little better. Come the 60s. This round? Oh wow. Boat is so much better than the crossbow. At least 0 one two. Because I just beat 48 with like NLL. So maybe relying on the 0 0 ace, not a good choice. Last try we lost 100 lives. So as long as I'm above 100 after this round, I'll be okay. But how? So I think close is the best choice. We just really have to hope for a good fire spot. Like in this intersection would be perfect, perfect. Now we just need to activate it. Okay. How many lives are we gonna leak? I see a rainbow, I see a lot of balloons. Down to 115, okay. I mean that's above 100, so I'll take it. This round is really no choice. It's just that tough. Really the first 60 rounds aren't that hard. It's when you get to 61, free play. You gotta be careful with using both fires on 60. Just cause you kinda need it. Um, fire, not yet. Now? Maybe we should just RNG our fire. If you don't know what I mean. What I mean is this. Fire? Oh there we go, yes, yes, yes. We just have to preemptively use it. But even then, we actually might be dead. Hold on, fuck. Are you kidding me? We're still dead? Cocktail at the start. Use fire when it pops. Keep waiting. Fire... Now? And I wonder if that does more damage. I can't really tell. So what if we RNG or Cocktail? Oh yeah, that's really good. We should NLL this. Come on, come on. There are yellows. A few balloons. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's great. That is exactly what you want to see. And we actually have Gwen number 2 up for this round. So we won't use this. Don't use this. Wait for all the balloons to come out. Use this. And now we just gotta deal with 5 Moabs. And that's it. So where's the fire going? Oh my god. Nice bug by the way. Although low-key, this still might work just because it still affects the balloons here. It will still work, guys. Don't worry. There are two BFBs inside left to deal with. Come on. Pink balloons. Okay, we'll take it. We'll take it. Eight lives lost. So we gotta hope that the boat gets all the purples. Because that's a lot of purples. I guess we use the fire once all these balloons come out. See these? That's gonna be an issue. Fortified Moabs. Also... They are Camo Riga Rainbow, so we gotta use fire. Not yet. We actually gotta wait. This is not good. Come on, there it is. Fire? That's gonna kill us. Wow. Might be dead this round, honestly. No matter what the strategy, we might be dead this round. Gwen on strong from the beginning? Yeah, let's try that. Gwen strong. I guess hitting the mobs does more. 
Granted, we're gonna leak lives here. That's why I don't want it on strong. You see? Because we're gonna keep leaking lives like this. Fire now. Gwen fire. That missed. Missed. Rip our lives here. Try again. Use fire at the start, maybe. Let's try that. Okay, that's pretty good. That's really good. And then fire now. That was a really good fire timing, by the way. Strong. Gwen on strong. And then the fire- oh no, 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 no. I- Dude. So that's the issue with Steam. I tried pressing ESC to pause, but because we hovered over Gwen's menu, it didn't let us. And we're dead. Is there anything we do to do better? Because cause I can use continue, but I think we're dead there. I'm pretty sure this round is like not impossible. So I think we're going to stop there, 62. So with 600 extra bucks, and starting on round 1, we can only make it 2 rounds further. Sadly. So that's about as far as you can get with 2019. If anybody else wants to try this challenge, feel free.